Medical costs are a huge strain for millions of Americans, pushing many into bankruptcy. But according to a healthcare advocacy, advocacy group, 80% of medical bills contain errors that, if corrected, could save you a lot of money. And fortunately, there are companies that help patients find those mistakes and fix them. Noreen Connolly is a journalism teacher diagnosed with cancer in January of 2009. Her dream was to go to the inauguration with some students, but instead watch the president being sworn into office on TV. A month later, she had a mastectomy. I recovered from the surgery very easily. When I started the chemo, that's when things really hit me. This was for real, you know. Um, but I had a lot of support, you know, the codes. There the was one aspect codes, of her treatment where Connolly didn't um, have support, paying her medical bills. The more paper I got, the more panicky and depressed I got. And I felt, um, I felt incompetent, really. And that made me feel worse. I finally, you know, I mean, I stopped opening the envelopes. This is actually one I got last year. But that didn't stop the bills from coming. In the end, she reports owing between fifteen and twenty thousand dollars. That's when she was introduced to a company called MedClaims Liaison and its founder, Nancy Kay. The company was created to help patients like Noreen sift through their medical bills and ultimately reduce their payments. She came to my house and we sat down. I brought out the box. She said, you're, you know, it happens a lot. In fact, 20% of insurance claims were misprocessed last year, according to the American Medical Association. When 20% are wrong, that causes a financial problem for physicians, for patients, and the overall health system. If you imagine that your credit card bill was wrong 20% of the time each month, you'd go crazy. Dr. Robert Waugh is chairman of the Board of Trustees of the AMA. He says billions are wasted each year on misprocessed claims. There's no specific bad guy, but it's very complex and it requires a lot of time, a lot of energy. It requires being relentless. In Noreen's case, being relentless meant combing through paperwork, getting the insurance companies to pay more, and negotiating with the hospital to get Noreen's bills lowered. There are two places where we can get the money back. Um, one is from the hospitals, uh, where a patient has either paid or been billed. And then the other area is from the insurance companies who have denied coverage on an initial appeal. Most med claims employees have experience in the healthcare industry and know ways of reclassifying procedures and negotiating payments that the average patient wouldn't. Med claims specializes in cancer, autism, addiction, and fertility. We focused on these areas because these are conditions that have a lot of insurance complexity um, and high out of pocket expenses. Med claims then takes a cut of the money it saves. On average, within four months, we've recovered $10,000 back for our customers. So it's a service that pays for itself very quickly. I wish that the monies that were spent on those companies could in fact be spent on health care that delivers better care for my patients. But for Noreen Connolly, med also. claims was about more than the $10,000 it saved her. Most of that's in the past. <laughs> it was about peace of mind. I wanted to pull the sheets up over my head and not, not know anything about this. And she basically took my hand and said, we can do this and did it. So you yes. can work with a company like MedClaims. You can also do this on your own, Terrell. So if someone's out there saying, well, I don't know if I can afford something like MedClaims, they take a portion of whatever proceeds you get back. But also, for those who think they might want to try this on their own, they can. You just have to be very attentive to detail. Go through literally every single piece of mail that you get from the hospital, from your insurance provider, and go back. There's, there's the ability to have that conversation with your doctors and the insurance company. So that's really what this company does, is they go through with a fine-tooth comb and they look at everything. Absolutely everything. That's yeah, it's great.